Hi, I'm the rap critic, and Ludacris is awesome. Seriously, he's one of the best rappers to ever put it down for the South. So when I heard his new song, My Chick Bad, I immediately wanted to bump it. But I was kind of thinking while listening to the song, do I like this song because, you know, it's actually good or because it's ludicrous? Well, let's analyze the lyrics and see. But first, let's hear that catchy chorus. My chick day, my chick hood, my chick do stuff that your chick do chick hood. It looks like the camera's filming the wrong side of the music video. All there is is just a girl dancing without any proper lighting. Very unprofessional. And Ludacris sitting in a chair. What are you doing? That's my job. I'm the one who gets to sit in the chair. You're the one who's supposed to make this video visually interesting in contrast to my boring background. I'm saying my chick bad, my chick hood. Yeah, we, we heard you on the chorus. My chick do stuff that your chick wish she could. You know what's kind of lazy? Filling up time by rapping part of the chorus on the verse. We heard it. You can move on. My chick bad, badder than your. Will you? My chick do stuff that I can't even put in words. Oh, ne ne never mind. My, my chick bad, tell me if you seen her. She always bring the racket like Venus and Serena. Hey look, a punchline that isn't a cliche and uses witty wordplay to get across its point. I kind of expect that from Ludacris, but after that Lil Wayne episode, I'm a lot more appreciative of him. Okay, that was another funny line, but at this point, I don't know if he's complimenting her strength as a woman or warning us of her sadistic rage. Okay, from that line, I'm assuming that she's known for ripping off nipples. I, I mean, that's the only thing I can deduce from you saying that. You want people to cover up their chests. Because she is known for ripping off nipples. Couple girlfriends and they all a little crazy. Coming down the street like a parade. Macy's. Hey, what? Are you doing the half the words I'm missing from the simile thing? Because that's that's annoying. I fill her up. Balloons. Okay, here's the problem with the whole unlinked simile thing. It sounds like you're playing a game of guess that simile, but you're playing it with yourself. Show them what I mean, guys. Number one, fill her up. Uh, balloons. Right, right, right. Okay. Number two, coming down the street like a parade. Um, Macy's. Right again. All right, last one. An object that is comparable to having a bad girlfriend. A grocery bag. What? I, I, I don't know either. You see what I mean? Test her and guns get drawn like cartoons. Oh. Finally, back to the properly composed simile structure. But I think his time is up. Uh, who's next? It's Nicki Minaj, right? Is she from the Young Money camp? Oh, let's get this over with. Now, 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 will these bitches want to try and be my bestie? But I take a left and leave them hanging like a testie. Interesting opening line there. So, um, I'm guessing that you're the aforementioned bad chick? How, uh, <clears throat> how, how, how you doing? Trash top, so I'm down, I put up, man, I have to. Oh. Running down the court, I'm dunking on them, Lisa, let's see. Hey, those lines are... Pretty good. I mean, sure, there's the unlinked simile thing in there, but it kind of feels like she's doing that because she didn't have enough room in the line, even though she could have probably, you know, rearranged some words around to make it fit. But now I'm just nitpicking. It's going down. Basement. No. Basements don't go down. Compared to where most people live, basements are down. And maybe that metaphor or simile or whatever you were trying to convey would have made more sense if you would have, yeah, no. Added a few words instead of doing this stuttering thing that seems to be throughout the whole song. Okay, that's enough. If I wanted to hear that much pointless repetition, I'd buy the new Black Eyed Peas album. But I digress. Friday the 13th, guess who's playing Jason? Hey, that's a bit much, don't you think? Uh, surely you're not that bad. I mean, that's just kind of overkill. Tuck yourself in your bed, I hold on to your teddy. It's Nightmare on Elm Street, I guess who's playing Freddy? Okay, I'm scared. Hey. No, your chick evil. Jeff cooking for me. They say my shoe came crazy, the mental asylum looking for me. <laughs> oh, she's not evil. She's just freaking crazy. I mean, uh, look at that last line. Out of context, she just told us that a mental asylum was looking for her. Even in context. What does that have anything to do with a chef cooking for her? You a bookie to me. I'm in that wham, bam, purple, lamb, damn, bitch, you been a Uh-oh. 
I think she just broke. Look, she's just throwing together words that rhyme without even trying to make sense. But seriously, somebody help her. All together, I gotta say, this is another song I really like. I mean, there are more than enough punchlines and witty wordplay to go around from Lulu, of course. And Nicki Minaj does pretty well despite her odd characteristics. I'm really looking forward to hearing more from her, actually. As well, the beat's kind of dark with the cellos, but still manages to be danceable and has a fun chorus to sing along to that never gets too annoying. As far as dance songs go, I'd give this a 5 out of 5. Anyways, and all the while, the song never gets too disrespectful to women, and I like that. And when we all alone, I might just tip on. She slides down the pole like a certified stripper. Well, that kind of caught me off guard. I mean, it felt like Ludacris just said, Eh, we need to add our 10% of objectification towards women in every single we do, so let's just throw that in there. And what's worse is the freaking edited version, and it sounds like the song's broken. And do girls like being called that? Especially girls who are known for, you know. I'm the rap critic. I just analyzed the rhymes, so Nicki Minaj, please don't rip my nipples up. I mean, uh, the, I... I, I analyze the rhymes because nobody wants to get their nipple. Nip, just. Answer.